Hey guys, it's Emily. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make this Christmas gnome out of socks. Let's get on with the video. You want to start off by getting a pair of socks of any color, and you want them to be longer than the ankle, just like crew socks. When you got your pair of socks, you want to take one of the socks and some rocks or pebbles and put them inside of the sock. You want to add enough so the gnome can stand when it's done. When you're done, you want to stuff the sock with pillow stuffing, up to about where the ankle would be. Then you want to roll down the sock until you reach the pillow stuffing and put some hot glue on the sock. Then you can bunch up the sock. Now you can start working on the beard and you want to start by cutting a piece of yarn that measures about 12 inches or a little larger than the body of the gnome. And you can use any type of yarn that you want. Then you want to tape the piece of yarn down, or you can attach one end of the yarn on a clipboard, and then you can tape down the other end, just like how I did. When you got your yarn taped down, you want to take another piece of yarn and measure how long you want your beard to be by folding the yarn in half and laying it on the gnome body. Then you can cut multiple pieces of yarn of that length. When you're done cutting the yarn, you want to take one of the pieces of yarn and fold it in half. Then you want to put the fold under the yarn that's taped down and pull the ends through the fold. All you have to do now is that you want to repeat the same steps for the rest of the beard. When you're done with your beard, you want to make sure you like the size of it on the gnome, and if it's too big, you can take off the yarn, or you can push them closer together. Now when you like your beard, you want to glue it on with hot glue. And you want to start from the middle and then glue the rest of the beard on. Next thing you want to do is that you want to get a wood bead of any size for the nose. And before you glue it on, you can place it on the beard so you get an idea of where you want it to be. Then you can put glue on the hole of the bead with hot glue and place the hole of the bead on the beard. Make sure the hole of the bead that has the glue on it is hidden in the yarn. And if you need to, you can add more glue behind the bead. 
Now for the hat, you want to take the other sock and put it on the gnome. Then you can glue it in place by starting out by putting glue on the nose and putting the sock over the hole of the bead. Then you can glue on the rest of the sock where you want it to be. And make sure you glue the hat down all around the gnome. After you're done gluing on the hat, you can trim the beard to the length or the shape that you want it to be. You can also trim the two ends of the piece of yarn that's being used to hold the yarn together. But make sure you don't cut it too short because the yarn might come off, but you can add some extra glue there and cover it with the hat so it stays where you want it to be. The last things you can do is that you can glue on a fake flower onto the side of the hat and you can also glue on a bell onto the end of the hat. Or you can decorate it in any way you would like. That's how you make this gnome. In the comments down below, let me know what you think about this DIY, and if you like this video, subscribe to see more videos. I will see you in the next video. Bye!